Welcome to Imperial CAD system. In this video we see how to get into Sketcher and how to create a sketch and how to constrain it. So this is a class where you can see the basics of a Sketcher in CATIA V5. So to get into Sketcher go for start mechanical design part design go for ok select a plane xy plane here we have a command sketch option select sketch and we get into sketcher of CATIA V5 these are all the toolbars you can move toolbars select this see here I am selecting profile option just create a basic sketch So, how to give dimension? To apply dimensions, here we have a command called constraint. Select constraint. See, select the line you can see. Applying dimension. Select constraint and I select this side line. To edit that, double click on that enter 5 inch double click that 6 inch I have entered some value then the sketch is under constraint sketch you can see the movement of this profile to fix this to make this sketch fully constrained you just double click on this constraint select this element double click on that and give a value double click give a value now to arrest this moment we have to give dimension with respect to axis horizontal axis horizontal line double click edit dimension vertical line and vertical axis double click this makes the sketch fully constrained if you give more dimension then the sketch the dimension appears in this uh, violet color that represents this color indicates that sketch is over constrained sketch right click on that dimension and delete instead of giving dimension with respect to axis we can also apply geometrical constraints see I delete this dimension with respect to axis select these two elements axis and this horizontal line by holding control select this option the first option in constraint a constraint defined dialog box you can see geometrical constraints here select coincidence here also I'm applying the same coincidence see you can you can see coincidence symbol so like this uh, to apply dimensional constraint dimensions uh, you have to select the command constraint to apply geometrical constraints like horizontal vertical 
coincidence tangency we have to apply geometrical constraints see if you want to make this horizontal select this line select geometrical defined box select this horizontal option see circle i want to apply tangency constraint with respect to this vertical line select these two elements first option go for tangency tangency like this this is a basic thing in catia create a profile make the profile iso constraint by applying dimensions by using the command constraint another basic thing is how to change units right now it is in inch system to change units go to tools options see parameters here you can change mm so these are all the toolbars we use in sketcher workbench catia v5 sketcher workbench and to move the screen you can press scroll and if you move mouse it moves the profile it moves the screen to rotate just press scroll and right button see we can rotate the object on the screen to zoom just hold or press scroll and one time right click then zooms in zooms out with mouse for a moment just press scroll you can move the screen to rotate press scroll i mean middle and right then rotates keep pressing middle and right to zoom only press middle keep pressing middle one time right button only one time right button zoom in zoom out to get back in normal position select here normal view this toolbar the name of this toolbar is a view toolbar select this so this is a basic thing which you need to know before beginning of the catia v5 software thank you for watching subscribe this channel for more videos